Welcome to my quick guide to starting the Cessna 172 Skyhawk from cold. In order to get the cold um, aircraft with the engine off, select the aircraft in the left screen, select customize, and make sure this box is unchecked. That box there is the start with engines running, so uncheck that. Right, then select your place to take off from. I'm going to take off from Paraparomu Airfield. So let's change location and we should start a new flight with the engine off. Right, we've spawned in with the engine off. So what we're going to do is apply the park brake. Park brake's on. Master battery needs to be turned on. That's there. Apply one of those two. Avionics need to be turned on. Turn on those two buses. Transponder is defaulting at 1200. That's correct. And we turn the beacon on. Now set the mixture to full rich. Push the red lever forward, full forward. Check props clear. It looks clear. Fuel pump on. Then magnetos all the way around to the start position and hold them down. There we go. Prop is spinning. Now we can turn the alternator on, which is the second of these two. We can now turn the fuel off fuel pump off and we can throw the navigation lights on and apply the tow brakes and then remove the park brake now we're ready to throttle up releasing the tow brakes and this aircraft is ready to fly so that is my very fast engine start from cold in the Cessna 172 that is probably not the way um, you want to do this for the greatest immersion there are obviously all the pre-start checks and there's also checking the um, checking your temperatures and pressures checking your dead magneto uh, left to right magnetos there's a few other things you would check in real life but if you're just wanting to get a basic as quick as possible start from cold that is a pretty reasonable way of doing it. And just before I forget, in the video description, I will save a link to a very short PDF, which you can print off, that actually has the, um, the start checks or the start procedure specified for you. Immediately prior to this procedure I just showed you, there's some very short pre-start checks, um, which you can also do if you want. But that PDF will basically give you something similar to what I just demonstrated. You can print it off, shove it on the wall behind your screen, and refer to that as you need it.